Yo, what up? This is Jay the Rapper with the new Fresh and Famous Anthem featuring Don Mega using Petey Pablo's Get Me Out of Jail beat. Make sure you hashtag Fresh and Famous theme song and hear it on FreshandFamous.com only because we be doing the kayak. Yeah. We be doing the kayak. Roll through the club. Looking so fly. Yeah. Got a few haters biting. 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 But our swag makes some sizes. Yeah. yeah. We be doing the kayak. Roll through the club. Looking so fly. Yeah. Fresh and Famous Radio. Fresh and Famous, we spend fresh music interview famous artists. Here we have a new bad girl from the new Bad Girls Club Season 9 in Mexico this July. Here to give us some teasers and new plans. Christina, what's the deal? Hey, what's up? Um, just chilling, you know, talking to the fans, having a good time. Nice, 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 nice. Now, now, word around uh, BGC fan mail is that you're actually one of the hottest uh, bad girls uh, for this season. Is is this true, or have you been getting that a lot, or what? Um, I've been getting it a lot. That I'm probably like the hottest and the toughest, and um, they've been calling me somewhat of the star. Really? I'm um, like, some of the girls are really pretty. I think I'm probably one of the hottest girls in the house. You know, I gotta have a little bit of confidence, mm-hmm. and um, I. I I think it's pretty cool that, you know, the fans are out there and they're, they're you know, considering me one of the prettiest girls in the house. Definitely, 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 definitely. And we have some fan mail, too. Uh, so how does it, here's actually what somebody said. So how does it feel to be on a brand new season of a worldwide show like Bad Girls Club Season 9? I mean, it feels really good. I'm excited to, you know, finally see myself on TV other than just the promos. Mm-hmm. Um, it kind of feels kind of fake that I actually have fans and people writing to me all day, but I mean, it's pretty cool. I just want to enjoy it for what it is and, you know, see, see you know, all the fun things that I could take during this whole new ride. Yeah, yeah. So since since uh, this Bad Girls Club isn't released just yet until July, uh, that takes us to the second fan question. Will it be Will it be better than the other seasons of uh, Bad Girls Club? I don't want to say that it's better because, again... I'm watching the new season with the fans. Mm-hmm. We're watching it together. I haven't seen it, but I do think what makes this one different is that we're out of the states. We're in Mexico. We're in a whole different country. Like you know, the people are different over there. You know, I've been to certain places over there, and you know, people couldn't even speak English, mm. and so it was just a whole different experience. That's so crazy. I think it'll definitely stand out. That's and crazy. We, we're definitely wilding in Mexico. <laughs> I mean, that's that's just amazing. I mean, just from how Mexico is right now, as far as like the drug wars and everything, you know, that's 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 pretty amazing. You know that you guys actually went out there. Uh, that takes us to question right. number three. Now that you're in the whole BGC loop, who can you say is one of your favorite bad girls from the past uh, seasons? One of my favorite bad girls. Um, well, I was never really big on watching bad girls, but mm-hmm. it, I mean, Camilla really stood out to me because. <laughs> she was fighting like four girls at once mm-hmm. and you know she held her own and, and left that way and, and I really respect that because I could kind of relate to her and you know I know how it feels to have to stand up to a whole bunch of girls at once <laughs> Definitely. I actually interviewed Camila. That's that's dope that you you know you said that. Uh, so here's here's something else. What can we expect from you in Bad Girls Club and of course in the near future? What it should definitely be expected is I'm a tough girl. Like I probably you can't expect anything too crazy from me because I like to keep it kind of conservative. But I definitely am a tough cookie, and you know I like to party and have fun. I just don't let no one walk all over me, and so I see a lot of toughness coming from me. Uh oh. Uh oh, I have a feeling, Christina, you're gonna you're gonna be a little brutal on on the season. <laughs> uh, I hope you. I, <laughs> just 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 let us know. All right, you don't have to give us because I don't like I don't like you know when you give us sneak previews. I don't like when any bad girls give us sneak previews. But just let us know. Did right. you did you pull out any hair? I pulled out some hair. <laughs> I definitely, definitely oh did. my god! Oh my god! <laughs> I had a nice big grip in my hand. Yes. Oh man, we cannot wait, Christina. This is gonna be crazy. This is, I, I'm not, and I'm not even a big, I'm, you know, I just can't wait for the fans to really see 
what I'm really about. Oh, uh, man. That's, and, th- and this the crazy thing is, like, you're the only person that I interviewed uh, for Bad Girls Club Season 9. So I, I think all the listeners out there are all excited for it. Dudes love Christina of Bad Girls Club. Make sure you tune in for Bad Girls Club Season 9 Mexico on the Oxygen Channel and follow her at Madame LaCris on Twitter. M-A-D-A-M-E underscore L-A-C-H-R-I-S on Twitter. All right, Christina, BBC9, the star, the goddess. Um, I love you, Jay. <laughs> I love you, too. How are we going, okay?